to the 2022 UCI Mountain Bike World Championships here in Leger, France. Ready to start, and we have started the final race here at the 2022 UCI Mountain Bike World Championships. It's the elite men Olympic cross country. Avon then straight out of the blocks into first place. Wow, Pitcock all the way back in the all pack the there. Yeah. He's got a lot. He could be playing the long game. Oh, mistake there then for Tituan Karad on the way into that rock section. Neo leading for the and first time. The number one plate to the front then. And these are oh, put out for Nino also for him. Some troubles. Oh, and he causes some problems behind yeah, him. Actually, yeah. gains time with that mistake. Nino, Nino still leading. Yeah, it's interesting, isn't it? Again, look at this. A big pack of six riders for the lead still. But here's Pitcock. He knows he hasn't got time to hang around. He knows he needs to get close to the front very soon if he wants to factor in this race here already. 2.2 laps out of the seven completed. And still nothing to separate these riders at the front. Nino Schurter, Jordan Soru, Sam Gaze, David Valero, Filippo Colombo, Luca Brido, Alan Hapley, Tito and Carrozza. Yeah, he's fallen back. Pitcock up to ninth now. Wow. <laughs> so we can see him. Elbows out, pumping those arms, pumping those legs, putting, trying to get every single watt through those legs. Well, let's see what Pitcock. Getting all crossed up there then. Nick Jordan Saru. We knew the World Championships in France would be something special, and they certainly have been. Jordan Saru, Valero, Luca Braido. Pain, it will be devolving lap after lap, so there'll be routes that weren't showing before on the lap. This is what these riders need to have in mind here as they ride around this course. And there he goes. Oh, look at this for an attack. Big attack. Wow, Pitcock really opening All the taps the way here. To the front. <laughs> wow, so Pitcock really on the move now. Less than uh, halfway through this race so far. Oh, shirt up, yes. He comes down. Oh, what's happened? He's struggling to get clipped back in. He's gone down in that turn. You can see the cloud of dust there. Wow. This race has just been blown wide open now then. Wow. Shirt up. Spain's David Valero. Ooh, now and Valero, attacks. yeah, sure. now, and now attacks into the lead. So it's his turn to control them. They're being treated. Oh, here comes a Schurter then. Schurter, Overtake. the nine times champ, overtake, overtaking Brido and Pickcock starting to fall back now behind Brido, down to fourth place. Coming up to the penultimate lap. Lap six of seven about to start. So Valera, quick check over the shoulder. It's oh. an attack then from Schurter. Here he goes. He's going to try and control this race from here. Look at everybody trying it. No one's got it. No one's got it. Valero is starting to go now, though. Look at those long legs. But even him, even him. And Peacock, he's falling a bit back. Yeah, he might have what just uh, emptied. What is going on? The, might have just emptied the tank too early. Just made uh, putting too much effort into trying to work his way. He had to work his way a long way back from uh, in the in the 30s at the start. Spain. And with this battle shaping up here between uh, Schurter and Valero, anything is possible. If they're going to be this close at the end of the last lap, then, uh, well, you can guarantee some fireworks. Oh, Pitcock! Oh, Pitcock oh, goes down. You, I think that tiredness really comes hey, to maybe. Yeah, and you see just how fast, though, these mechanics are able to change. 
signifies the last lap. Here we go. That's big. That's big, and we're gonna see. <laughs> we're gonna see some game going on now between these two. Oh, Here we go. We then. Go. Here's the attack. We know that Valero wants to get in, in front through this technical section, this key section of this course, but Schurter holding steady. In second. Oh, wow, look at this for a sprint then from Schurter. He has dropped Valero. Wow. Is this the attack that for the gold medal? Style. Wow, over the jumps as well. It's going to be very hard for Valero to make us make up ground, especially on a gifted, uh, technically rider. Uh Look at the gap that he created. That is some damage that Nino did to Valero. Yeah. <laughs> He's shaking his head. He can't believe it. Oh, he can't believe, he can't it. believe it. Ten times Nino Schurter. He's going to be a ten-time world champion. Serrano, what a race from him, a silver medal, look. <laughs>